this is a story that has been told many times before me. It's about a hotel, a hotel run by kids. They thought they knew what they were in for, but had no idea one smell could bring down an entire business. I present the Grand Kids Hotel. Problem, miss. There's a terrible smell coming from my room. My wife should not have to deal with this. Oh, I'm very sorry for your trouble. She has trouble sleeping. This is absurd. I'll speak to the manager. Fine. We have a problem. You're right. These numbers are all over the place. We need an accountant. Mr. and Mrs. Goldstein are very upset. What now? They say there's a funny smell coming from their room. What sort of smell? What sort of smell? A foul smell! Oh. They say it's a foul smell. Well, send in Martha! Martha? What? Remy said you need to clean Mr. and Mrs. Goldstein's room. I'm busy. Why should I? Huh? Um, because you're the maid? Okay, bellhop. <laughs> Harriet? What is it, Remy? Whoa, line up, Harriet. I'm sorry, it's just me and Frank are in a fight. Frank? My husband. Oh, right. Well, Harriet, we are having several issues today which we could use your help with. He just never takes me out on any dates anymore. We just don't have any fun. That is unfortunate. <laughs> Did Martha not clean up the bed bugs in that room? Five dollars for a bottle of mineral water? What a rip off! That's not a bad price. Let's cheap. Where's my baggage? That bellhop never brought it to my room. 
I want a refund. What did I do with that luggage? This isn't good. That's where our story ends, unfortunately. They didn't get the smell out and nobody ever came back. The moral of the story is, I guess the Holiday Inn isn't so bad after all. Till next time.